again, they're telling me to do integration by parts and, and looking at it, you know, certainly uh, you say, what are the parts? I got to find the parts to it. And the first thing I'd probably say is um, it would probably be easy to take u to be natural log of x. And why, why would that be the case? It just, it looks easy to differentiate, but really tough to integrate. And I shouldn't say really tough, tougher to integrate. So what do you get over here? du would be 1 over x dx. And then I would take x to the minus 4 dx to be the dv. You notice where it's a negative power. The reason being, it's easier for me to handle it. What do I do? Increase the exponent by 1, so it's minus 3 over minus 3. So I'll simply say this over here. And that's when, what the v is going to be equal to. Let's write it down. So I put down equals uv. So that's going to be minus the natural log of x over 3x cubed minus an integration, the VDU. So I'm going to say plus 1 third x to the minus 3. And then the DU is going to be 1 over x dx. Well, it doesn't look that bad. Let's keep going. This is minus ln x over 3x cubed. Now, I want to point out this over here is actually x to the minus 4. If you're to, um, you know, integrate that, you're going to add 1 to the exponent, which would make it minus 3. Divide through by minus 3, what do you get? You can get minus 9 then. All right, there's already a 3 at the bottom. Plus c. Let's put up a box in this guy over here. I don't know what the answer could look like. Let's take a look. And... I really do mean that. Take a look. Are you seeing this? Yes. I'm seeing the opposite of the natural log of x divided by 3x cubed. Am I seeing this? Sort of. The only difference is they took the x minus 3 and put it as x cubed in the bottom. And I see the plus c. We're good to go to the next question. Thank you.